Rockies hosting the Orioles. The Orioles are minus 164 on the money line. The Rockies are plus 138. The over under 11 and a half runs. The Orioles laying a run and a half on the run line are minus 115, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win by two or more. And the Rockies getting a run and a half on the run line are minus 104, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. The weather is supposed to be 86 degrees with eight mile an hour winds from the right to the left and no rain. And it'll be curious to see how this game holds up against the college football lineup that they have going on tomorrow. Neither of these pitchers pitched against the opposing team last year or this year. Head to head, they're five and five against each other. The road team's on a two game winning streak. The home team is five and five. The favorite is six and four on the money line, while the underdog getting a run and a half on the run line is eight and two. There have been five one run games in their last ten. The unders hit in their last two. The over is six and four, and the under eleven and a half is seven and three. The Orioles are two and three in Kremer's last five starts. The over is four and one in those starts. Five and a third innings pitched, four point eight hits. 2.8 earned runs, 4.6 strikeouts, 2.8 walks, 0.2 home runs, 95 pitches, and 17.7 pitches per inning. For the Rockies, 2-3 and three in Feltner's last five starts. The under is 4-1, and one, however, being that it's in Colorado, his over-unders have been much higher. Five innings pitched, 5.2 hits, two runs, 1.8 of which were earned, 3.6 strikeouts, 1.6 walks, one home run per game, 76.2 pitches per game, and 16.7 pitches per inning. So both of these pitchers have low ERAs. The Orioles are 5-5 five and five in their last 10, 2-2 two two in their last 4. 5 runs, 10 runs, 9 runs, 8 runs, 3 runs and a win, 4 runs and a loss, 3 runs and a loss, 5 runs and a win. For the Rockies, 1-3 and three in their last 4. 17 runs, 10 runs, 20 runs, and then 8 runs. 8 runs and a loss, 8 runs and a win, 8 runs and a loss, 3 runs and a loss. Orioles with the money line. Orioles laying the runs and the under. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.